Alright, so since the last time I made a Fallout Shelter video, which has been over a week now, I've basically been signing in every day and allowing my main questers to upgrade all of their um, stats. So, most of them are completely maxed out. Um, I think there's like some of them that have like a 9 stat, but I'm tired of not doing quests, so we're going to go ahead and start. Um, and in that same amount of time, we have, um, whoops, I have, uh, acquired some vaults, I mean some lunch boxes, so, oh, I have to put in dwellers first, okay, well, I'm gonna assign them to all trains, so give me one second, alright, so I put them all in, so let's do these lunch boxes, let's see what we get, okay, bullshit, Bullshit. Terrible. Terrible. Uh, whatever. Okay. Bullshit. Bullshit. Crap. Come on, come on, come on. Damn. Bullshit. I'm hoping for some more unique um, dwellers. Crap. 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 Wow, this has been... Just uneventful as all hell. Okay. Alright, that's okay. Alright, so from what I remember, we were stuck here because we didn't have enough high levels because it's a level 46 quest. So today, or right now, I'm going to do this lunchbox run. The finishing the Great Tato Famine. And I am going to do the next Paula quest. Oh, wait, I just realized I'm not giving them any. Well, they should be fine. It should be okay. I'll just give these people them, even though they're going to need the least. I'm a little rusty. Alright, so let's go ahead and start these. I'm probably going to have to add some more food for all ten of my new dwellers. And I'm going to throw this Mr. Handyman back out into Mr. Handy. Where'd you go? I just put him here. There he is. Okay, put you back out. Explore. Alright. We're going to start with this lunchbox run. We have to recover the lunchbox. Alright, let's go. Oh, it's good to be back. And like I thought, they're not. I'm not really worried about stim packs. Boop, boop, boop. Come on now. Ooh, a shovel. Fine booty. I forgot how much I like Grandpa. Okay, come on. There we go. I did unlock some themes. I didn't realize, even though it's obvious now, that you have to craft the themes in the workshop to use them. Which is why there's a theme workshop room. Which is super obvious, but it didn't click for me until I was doing all this stuff and just messing around, not going on any quests. It takes forever to uh, upgrade someone all the way in every stat. I was thinking for a while that I was going to do that for all my guys, but really it's only super important for the questers. Um, and then the other people is just to upgrade the stat that the, whatever room they're working in. Um, so you can find more shit if your perception's higher. Um, you have more health if your endurance is higher. If your agility is high, you hit more often. So a lot of that stuff is super important for questers. But within the vault, unless you're including like when the vault gets attacked, 
which they barely get anywhere now because my weapons have gotten better, um, then it's really not that important. Yeah, we're going to keep exploring. How big is this place? That's not too big. Well, you should have been more prepared. You don't read guides on how to kill people. That's all I'm saying. That's That would be strange. Some weird corner of the dark web. Much less likely to find in print. Oh, I got some right away. Okay. Yeah, I'm ready to be done with this too. Okay, but we have to get the rest of the rooms. You know how we roll. And this is easy. This is like shooting fish in a barrel anyway, Grandpa. Alright. That roach had a nice gun on him. Cool. That looks like an enhanced rifle. too much sometimes. Oh, I forgot to pick him up. Got him. Oh, he had like 300 something coins on him. I'm glad I went back for that. And a microscope. And there she blows. Return to vault. Okay. Theme recipe fragments. So our next Paula Plumpkin quest, gotta find Vault 525. How big is this place? It's not too big. That was a waste of a nuke star. No, it seems like you have infinite, so that's fine. Okay. Tell me which way to go again. miss you mole rat I'm in the bottom first someone's gonna tell me I'm going the wrong way beep, beep, beep. Pick up this red roach, or red scorpion. Oh man, not even worth it. Now I gotta get this mole rat. Oh my god, go in there. I see you back there, locker. Impacts. Might actually need them. Or not. Okay. 
Ooh, an alpha death claw. Shablow. Not gonna waste it. Kill the rest of them. There we go. Last area. We're all done. Alright, so our next mission is the final Tato Famine mission. So we're going to go ahead and do that one. Good old Mole Rat Man. Got Moira on her laser Gatling gun. to go and we need to keep getting those levels so we can hit 46. There is surprisingly lots of mole rats for mole rat man. Hell yeah, look at all that Nuka Sola soda. Come on, we gotta find the leader.
I expected him to look weirder, like with a mole rat costume or something. quest. Probably just barely get past it. Alright, well as far as Final Quest goes, that was pretty un anticlimactic. I feel like they could have made him weirder. Well, I would have put him in a mole rat costume. Alright, so we got one more lunchbox from the lunchbox run, the daily quest, so I'm going to open that up. Crap, 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 crap. Come on, person. Damn it. Okay, so now we're going to send this team out on... The special mission, the Wasteland the Musical. Well, I can only send one. Confessor Cromwell it is. Why do I have to stop them from singing? Seems kind of harsh. Well, that was special. I didn't like their song, so I'm going to kill them.
Good, I was hoping to fight them. I don't like the Atom people. What? They didn't sing to me? Fucking assholes deserve to die. Alright, so that was an interesting quest, um, done there, it seemed more like a spoken word poem than a musical, but, so I didn't hear any music, but, that's four quests, so I'm gonna go ahead and call it enough for now, um, so until next time.